Yeah, we're, I mean, we're on day two. We got about five days left of our FTX is here. And, oh, we're almost done, so I'm just looking forward to that. <laughs> Next mission, I'm not so sure of. That's with the, the new leadership. They will know, and then kind of they'll delegate it down to, you know, to the average Joes, and um, that's kind of how you'll know about it. So I guess we'll, we'll see what happens next. I think it's usually a defense, um, so we'll probably just set up around the area, defend the objective, get things going, and then just wait for the enemy. So I'd say the importance of this is just, I mean, your main mission is to defend the objective. Um, and I mean, there's there's contingencies on whether or not like you should leave the objective or not. But like again, your mission is to stay, defend the objective, unless I mean higher up kind of wants you to do whatever they want you to do. I'd say the grand takeaway is that I mean you just learn something from it. Granted, we are being graded, uh, evaluated right now. Um, only the leadership positions, but like still, everybody has their part to play in the whole mission, whether you're being evaluated or not, because. Um, later down the road, it can come to, to where you're in leadership being evaluated and you, you really want to rely on those just average Joe's shoulders to really help you out. That's, I'd say that's a big thing that we all rely on each other for is teamwork. I decided to become an officer for many reasons, uh, mainly particularly, you know, just help with school, um, follow my father's footsteps. He's, he's been in for about 27 years, um, so I really look up to him. He's a role model. I don't know, just like telling him about like my experiences and my process of me becoming an officer. like. He does definitely encourage me. He's proud of me. He always tells me he is. Um, and like, he just, he gives me tips. He helps me out just because he has that experience. You know, 26 years will do it for you. So you grow up as a kid with your dad being an officer and it's, you see those kind of qualities in him. And I feel like just being raised by him, like I've adapted to, you know, have those qualities as well. So that's kind of just how my life's been going.